What's happening guys? Let's hop into DaVinci Resolve and show you how to make some auto-generated subtitles. Oh, one thing I wanted to mention real quick. This feature is only available in the studio version of DaVinci Resolve, the paid version. So if you are in the free version, unfortunately this won't be available to you, but I mean, this might be as good of a reason to upgrade as any. So with that said, let's hop into it. All right, first thing we're gonna wanna do is come up to timeline and click create subtitles from audio. This little pop-up box will come up. We can choose our language. Uh, we can choose whether or not we want single or double lines. The double would have like stacked captions. Maximum characters per line is where we can do a little bit of adjusting. Um, in our case, we're working with a vertical video. If you want that uh, effect where it's like one word at a time, you're gonna wanna go with less characters per line. We have it set around 10, which is pretty good. You can adjust and see what works for you. But we're gonna hit create and DaVinci gonna do its thing. DaVinci gonna do, hey, all right, it's done. So as you can see, DaVinci has created a new line with all of our captions and they are synced up to the audio. And this is great, this is exactly what we wanted, but let's say you're not jiving with the font, you wanna change the color. All of this is completely customizable. So we're gonna come in here and click on one of our captions. And as you can see now on the right side of the screen, we have a little caption box. Uh, if this isn't showing up for you, just make sure the inspector tab is ticked on. And we have a caption and a track option. And you can think of the track option as um, affecting all of your captions at once, which is super great and super quick if you wanna change all of the font or make global adjustments. So we're gonna come in here and just adjust the size a little bit, maybe the position, and we'll, we'll give it a different font. Uh, that looks good right there. So now as you can see when I scrub through here, that applied to every one of our captions. But let's say we wanna come in here and maybe change the color of certain captions. If you click back on the caption side, and you'll see this little checkbox here, customize caption. Now, these adjustments are only going to, the be, to be made to the caption that you're on. So let's say we wanna change this to maybe green to, to highlight it a little bit and maybe make it even a little bit bigger. And you know, you can, you can change the font. And this caption track here is completely adjustable just like any video track would be. So let's say you want to click and drag some of these, adjust them. Maybe you want center of to show up center and then of. So we can come in here, center of the and cut we can delete of from the first one as you can see another caption was generated we can delete center from that and now center of the people who are already searching for all right so you've done all your customizing and you're ready to export let's do that we're going to come all the way down here to the little rocket ship Click on that. And for the sake of this tutorial, I'll keep things pretty basic, but if you want a whole video dedicated solely to export settings, please let me know. Anyways, we're gonna stick with custom export for now. Give your video a title, select where you wanna save it to. And then if you are using vertical video, make sure you have this little checkbox clicked, use vertical resolution. And then we're gonna come all the way down to the bottom here where it says subtitle settings. Scroll on down. Make sure this export subtitle is checked and we're going to click on burn into video. And there are other options here if you want your subtitles to be in a separate file and maybe you upload those to YouTube for captions, but for the sake of this video, we're gonna stick with burn into video and then we'll just click add to render queue. All right guys, I hope you found that video helpful. If you did, the best way to help us out is by giving the video a like and subscribing if you wanna see more content like this and we'll catch you in the next video.